Hello everyone, welcome to back my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up 90 day fiancé. Happily ever after, star Michael Ilisami has finally revealed why he ran away from Angela Deem's Georgia house. Michael came to the U.S. in December 2023. Michael and Angela had been together for eight years by then and had been trying to get Michael a visa since 2017. Angela was always the jealous and suspicious type. She kept tabs on Michael's social media activity, tried to track his phone location, and even didn't allow him to go to work. If Michael thought coming to America could solve this issue, it only made things worse. Michael is currently living in Alvin, Texas and has a new family there. He has a lot of friends he keeps posting about on social media and is rumored to be dating a woman named Megan. Meanwhile, Angela continues to accuse Michael of scamming her while he insists he is innocent. Fans have no other option but to believe Michael, since they've watched Angela's intense outbursts caught on camera for almost a decade including the fights where she also got physical. Michael escaped his Angela earlier this year and is clearing the air about his disappearance. On February 26, 2024, Angela claimed that her husband had gone missing and had left all his belongings behind. She did a YouTube Live with blogger and friend John Yates and revealed that Michael had been missing since the 23rd and that the police were involved. We can't find him she added. Interestingly, Angela had shared some cryptic Instagram stories right before Michael's disappearance. According to Newsweek, Angela had shared the quotes, you've been lied on, talked about, plotted against, and STLBLESSED, and manipulation is when they blame you for your reaction to their disrespect. Read that again. Michael is safe. There's the good news. He reached out to the police, John Yates revealed in a YouTube Live with Angela later that day. Michael had told the police that he was okay. While he was fine, Michael did not want to talk to his wife. He said he was in fear for his life. Michael didn't want Angela to know where he was. Meanwhile, Angela denied having ever mistreated Michael. He asked him to tell the truth. She claimed she was worried sick thinking Michael was hurt. She accused him of fabricating the claims to stay in the U.S. Michael broke his silence about his disappearance in a recent interview with E.T. Michael said that the reason why he left Angela's house was very, very sad. Michael said he felt like he was an unwanted guest and wasn't treated like he was Angela's husband. I was treated like I'm just a nobody, he added. Michael said they were arguing and fighting every day. He said things got to a point where he couldn't bear it anymore. Michael claimed he never planned anything and he doesn't have any woman he's talking to or dating in America. According to Michael, the only woman he had in his life was Angela. When asked where he went when he escaped, all Michael said was that he suffered. The final straw was Michael felt he was treated poorly by Angela. Michael added Angela could do whatever she wants whenever she was upset. He tried to keep things cool because he didn't want to have a bad record in the U.S. Angela made Michael feel scared when she was upset. She was monitoring him and checking his phone all the time. Michael said he only flirted with the woman in 2022 to make himself feel better, and he didn't mean anything by it. According to Michael, Angela got mad at him every time he asked her about his green card. Michael insists the show didn't change Angela. Michael believes Angela took advantage of him because he's a very chill guy and easygoing person. He added that Angela's aggressive behavior was not okay and it could have been a different scenario if he was the one that did that to her.